the biblical truth of our hymn. Today we're going to do only trust him. And we'll get right into it. It, it was used in current hymnals in the revivals of Dwight L. Moody and Ira Sankey. So in the preaching of Dwight L. Moody, we have the invitation hymn. He was a Methodist Epith Episcopal Church minister, John H. Proctor. And he's going through this. He left the Presbyterian Church and joined the Methodist, converted at the age of 21. He became a licensed preacher in 1844 and a full member of the New Jersey Council Conference of the Methodist Episcopal Church in 1857. Uh, his ministry was cut short by an illness in 1874 and he died in 1877. So. And we got a tremendous hymn here. Come. You know what? This is out of Isaiah 118. Now, uh, I just said his name. Dwight L. Moody put Matthew, all the air labored, heavy laden, come to me to rest. And it's proper, but I see Isaiah 118. Come. That's an invitation. Come. That's an invitation in Revelation 22. Every soul, whatever race, color, sex you are, are you a living soul? By sin oppressed. We're all sin oppressed. All have sinned and come short of the glory of God. There's mercy with the Lord, capital L. Amen. You know what mercy is? Mercy is the Lord Jesus Christ. Mercy is for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Instead of going to hell, you have <coughs> an opportunity through God to go to glory. And, I, and he, God, Jesus, will surely give you rest when we get to glory, when we get to heaven. Uh, there's no rest on this earth. All they that live God in Christ Jesus shall suffer persecution. So that rest is when we get to heaven. By trusting in his word, look at the capital W, John chapter 1, John chapter 5. That's Jesus Christ. For Jesus shed his precious blood is not water. The hymn's not water. The hymn's not going to church. The hymn is by the blood, by the blood of God, Acts 20, 28, by the blood of Jesus. Not a work, but the precious blood. Oh, notice it said Jesus even. Many hymnals don't have Jesus. Many hymns don't have the blood. So I guess there are certain denominations that are against the blood of Jesus. Can't sing this hymn. Rich blessings to bestow. Rich blessings from the one that is rich by all that there is, is of God. Plunge now into the crimson flood that washes white as snow. There is Isaiah chapter 1 verse 18. Come now, let us, come now, let us reason together. Though your sins be as scarlet, they should be white as snow. Only trust him comes from Isaiah 118. And Mr. Scotton says, plunge into that flood. Plunge into that blood. Don't plunge into water. Don't plunge into a church attendance. Don't plunge into your work. Plunge into the blood of Jesus Christ. All right, now we got a, we got one problem. Remember, a hymn is not the Bible. A hymn is not the inspiration of God. Yes, Jesus is the truth, the way. John 14, 6 says, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth. The hymn writer reversed it. I don't know why he would reverse it. And I looked at the modern versions. And the modern versions say, Jesus is the way and the truth. 
So I don't know why he would put the truth in the way reverse. That leads you into rest, that heavenly glorified rest in New Jerusalem. Believe in him. Capital H. Well, the modern Bibles in Acts chapter 8 take out, I believe Jesus is the Son of God, and plunges you right into the water. This hymn plunges you in the blood and believe on Jesus. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. Without delay. Don't do it tonight. Don't do it tomorrow. Don't do it next year. Do it now. You may not have another minute. Any moment the Lord Jesus Christ may come for his church. Any moment death could be knocking at your door right now. Without delay and you are fully blessed by the blood, by the belief. By the finished work of the Lamb of God, that God says, come, it takes away the sin of the world. Come! That's an invitation. Then, and join his holy band in heaven. Now, that's not a holy band of, you know, uh, musicians. That's the holy group of people in heaven. That's the seraphim. That's the cherubim. That's the angels. That's the saints. That's the Old Testament saints. <clears throat> the church age saints, soon the tribulation saints. And on to glory go, New Jerusalem. To dwell in that celestial land where joy and mortal flow. It's about the gospel. It's about salvation. What do you do? Only trust him. Didn't say do something. Didn't say join something. Didn't say give nothing. It says trust him. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. Only trust him if you didn't get it the first time. Only trust him. If you didn't get it three times. Now. Don't wait. He, Jesus, will save you. He will save you if you didn't get it. He will save you now if you only trust him now. If you call upon him now without delay. That's remarkable. We've got a hymn that has the name of Jesus. we got a hymn about the blood of Jesus. We've got a hymn about the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. We've got... God reaching out to the sinner saying, come. I put only trust him in, in the hymnal to be sung in the church. But not all religions can sing because Jesus shed his precious blood. Not all Christians believe that. I do. I have believed. I am saved. My name is the Lamb's Book of Life. Only, only come to Jesus. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, and thou shalt be saved. Glory to God.